Hello, this video is for uh, small utilities for uh, placing the objects and moving with their position during play mode in editor. It's uh, really simple, but it can be really huge time saver because when you are creating some levels of your game, uh, it's you can play for example about the two three minutes and then you will realize uh, that some object is in wrong position and you can start again so i think it's really um, you can waste time when you are placing that objects and you have to test it so it's good chance to have that move that objects during play mode but there's a problem when you turn it off uh, that play mode that object position will reset to previous position or will be removed from the game so it's a really huge problem and so this is solution it's not so perfect but uh, you have some conditions how to use it but I still s think that it can be useful so I will show how it works uh, I will launch my game okay so I'm in my game I will speak with this NPC to unlock world objects okay so I will look inside that uh, inside this room okay so that room is not perfect because i did it okay first of all uh, this bed i think it's okay i will put it more to wall this chair i will put more here and I will try to add some new objects to the scene as you can see that uh, okay so I have here folder models and here is ruin oh no here is ruins so I will it's what is it? oh it's too big it's too too big <laughs> so i will put for example okay another chair oh s come on it's uh, too big because okay i will delete this and i will use some made prefab what i have so i will use okay so i will create a new shell and I will add okay, inspector is here, so I used this rotation. Okay, so I will put that shelf here, for example, so at least uh, that room will be uh, with new object. So now I have to put that shelf inside the new objects, uh, created new objects new objects game object uh, so it's one condition when you want to use it and the second main condition is that script that will do that must be attached editor object placer must be attached as uh, to the parent game object of all object that you can move so these objects must be um, can be marked as static so it, it means that they cannot be removed from the game or cannot move so it's only for decorations that are not moving so it's for example wrong when you will put for the items that you can pick up or they can be removed from the scene so for example this chair will be always as a decoration so i will s i change position of bed of chair and i, I added new shelf so okay so of course I can add just much much more but this video is only for purpose to show you how it works so for example I can go to the new level to that orcs cave and add some objects during the play mode I can you can add anything you can want but only condition is that you have to put inside that new objects so now uh, I will launch it again so Yes, there is that shelf now. 
so now uh, you have to store it this so you will press one key T key so now it's stored and you can leave it I will s open the scene start map okay so there is that my house again okay it, it of course it's without shelf so now you will select this and uh, I will s s uh, enter the correct name of this map so it's name star map and now you have to wait because this is long it has lots of game objects so I will put restore and it's done so you can see that shelf is back on the position oh sorry I have to uncomment <laughs> Sorry, I just recompiled that code because I had a small mistake with uh, so I had just on placing objects. So now I will <laughs> restore again, and that shelf will move with position, but it will take some time. So as you can see, that bed and sh uh, chair moved with the position. So uh this is the object placer the new objects are created with this prefab so then you can uh, of course set up to the correct position where it should be and delete this uh prefab from your map so thanks for watching and if you are interested just let me know